obstacles, when shared correctly, can turn into great blog content that will resonate with your audience. Remember, every moment is a marketing moment in the making. Yes. Every single moment is a marketing moment in the making. So in addition to having images that grab people's attention, having choice words that grab people's attention, you also need to have PR content where you share. Where you, I love that, Anissa, you did your introduction. And at first, it was just kind of serious. But when you got more personal, you felt like you were talking to the girls. It was all right. It was all right. And when you do your videos, people want to feel like they're sitting in the room with you, talking with you. They don't want to feel like you're saying, hi, I'm Vanessa Barbie. Come to Tax Chick. They don't want to feel like a commercial. Because when people use something like YouTube, like I mentioned yesterday, they want to either be informed or entertained, right? So they don't want to see commercials. They watch TV for that. If they're on YouTube and they're, you're not, they're not there, to hear you as an entertainer, they're looking for you to inform them, which means you've got to have a personal conversation, not a commercial conversation. Okay? Now, PR content. Inside the RTW assessment quiz that you all just did, you will find quite a few items that you can turn into marketing material. So visibility. Make note of your business associates and industry professionals in your circle. Talk about them, your business associates. Interview them. Get their feedback on your business. Sales a trigger worth mentioning, because I said we're going to be talking about sales triggers. Brand affiliations. Who you are affiliated with. Establish brands you're affiliated with. Goes a long way, and the brand coach, Jay Stone, she knows that. So when you think about your business associates from that quiz, you can use that as content on your website. You can talk about these people that you're associated with on one level or another, because then when people see you are connected to that brand, and if they trust that brand, that affiliation is going to carry over into your business. Yes, they have, that is the key. They don't trust that brand or know that brand. It's not going to help. Right. It's got to be somebody they know and trust. When you think again about this RTW quiz, searchability, right? The keywords I said, do you have keywords or key phrases for your business? At this point, you should have at least a few. But here's the key here. Knowing that you have that, these phrases that you want to integrate into your website, that content becomes a part of your agenda. So for example, yesterday, Beverly, we were talking about your Amazon, your reviews, and what did you say this morning? What happened this morning? Oh yeah, the review I got from a woman who um, was not a boomer, who gave a really glowing review and said that the book was for non-boomers. I was very surprised to get that review since I did not know her at all, and she's not connected to me on social media. She mm -hmm. just bought the book, and I'm not even sure how she found it. Because you're searchable? It's because you're wow, searchable. There we go. There we the, go. Title, the title of the book alone. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that was an excellent title. How to get on the news? Yeah. Without, so she had the whole title. So, oh, yeah, how to get on the news without committing murder. Without committing that, and, and you know what? Yeah, yeah, not just that. You do it. <laughs> that, that's going to be a book. That's going to be a video series. That's going to be a workbook. That's going to be, you right. take that brand and, 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 and create, and actually create that website.com, the, the e-books. I mean, you actually can drill down several layers and break, you know, the book up into courses. Yeah, workshops. That's, workshop. yeah. that's workshops. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's a two-day PR workshop. So, I'm saying, <laughs> ride it to the wheels, Father. Right. <laughs> right. Now, yesterday, on that topic of riding it to the wheels, Father, we're talking about content. And so yesterday, and you'll see in your workbooks, you've got several categories of headlines. The subject headers is important as far as attracting. And so I said to Beverly, you're going to take that headline and you say, don't be, say the title for me. Uh, the title you said, of your book. Don't, uh, you don't get on the news without committing murder. Not just for boomers. 
Boomers is her, one of her key words as far as the target audience that she's trying to reach. And so, and then you can do for college students. We talked about Already within what you have. 